Hi, James Whale here, and you're watching Weird World Fives. This week's top five are looking at the oddest mythical creatures. People may have already heard of Bigfoot, the Loch Ness Monster, but I bet you haven't heard of any of these before. At number five, Cockatrice. I'll say it again, Cockatrice. You have heard of it? No, you haven't. It was a mythical creature which was said to kill a man with a single glance. I can do that. By turning them into stone with one of its poisonous saliva glands. Its appearance was described as a rooster's head and feet with the body and scales of a dragon. Its only weakness was a weasel immune to its gaze and the crowing of a cockerel which would cause fatal fits for the creature. I'm not making this up. Number four from Latvia. They have their own answer to why your cheeks go numb in winter. Looks. He was said to appear as an old man in a winter coat of animal fur carrying a crystal axe. Lusks would visit your house in winter and use his axe to check the structural integrity. He would also pinch your cheeks, nose and ears when you go outside causing them to go red and numb. Strange being number three. Chinese mythology makes note of a creature called Quilin. Normally its appearance would coincide with the birth or death of a ruler. A quillin was said to have a single horn on its forehead, a yellow belly, I know something like this, a multicolored back, horse's hooves, deer's torso, and an ox's tail. Yes, I know that person. Number two weird being, a blemies, was a strange creature that was said to reside in North Africa and the Middle East, and at a glance they would look human, but without a head. Their facial features were instead on their torso, and they would often be attributed to cannibalistic behavior. Freaky. And number one, the weirdest thing in the world. Japan has a large frequency of earthquakes yearly, a geological hotspot, or a giant catfish. Namazu, according to Japanese mythology, is the cause. Moving his tail causes the earth to shake. Supposedly, he could only be controlled by the god Kashima, who is able to push the catfish underground and immobilize him. However, the god would get tired or distracted, allowing Namazu to move and thus cause earthquakes. That was your Weird World Fives for this week, and if you have any of your own, be sure to pop them in the comments below. And if you want to see more videos like this video and subscribe to our channel, well, please do so. Thanks, and see you next time.